Hello and welcome. A couple of days ago I received this tool and to my big disappointment um, it had no instructions within it on how to use it. I've just received it in a white bag like this one without anything else included. So well you don't know what you get what you will get when you buy things online. I've done my research now I know exactly how to use it and um, this tool is being used not only to tie hooks to the line but you can also join braid to liver you can tie jig heads, swivels, uh, spit clips and many other things with it just use your imagination as you can see it is mainly made from plastic it has this door that you can open and within it it has those sections so those sections are actually needed to put the hooks starting from the bigger one and ending with the smaller one. On the back it has this metal part which is actually a line cutter. I'll just um, use a quick demonstration and I'll just show you how easily it cuts the line. So you just take the line, put it through, pull it and that's it. Okay, so before I will show you how to use this tool, you can like the video and support my channel so that more people would see it. The first thing which you need to make sure, you need to, to put this metal part on your ring finger and open the door. Now take your hook and put it into the section which you think will hold it best in my case I've got a pretty small hook so I'll put it into the top section and close it down so it holds it firmly the knot which is being used with this tool is a clinch knot but you can use other ones if you wish but um, the clinch is the most common one so when you've placed the hook into the tool you take the line you put it through the eye of a hook, make it a double line and just spin the tool about 5 or 6 times but you can do it like 10 times, 11 times, it does not really matter. Um, the next thing which you will need to do, you will need to put the end of the line through the loop which is closer which is closer to the hook and then you put it through the loop which we have just done the next step is to wet the line and then just pull the knot tight as you can see pretty quick and easy so that's basically it um, and one more time if this video was useful just put a thumbs up in order for more people to see it and um, I'll see you in the next one. Thank you for watching.